Gathering 2023, also commonly known as G4, if I'm not mistaken. Not to be confused with the other G4. <laughs> Let's not even go there, right, brother? Yeah. Okay, so Mike, um, just uh, real quick, a little bit of history. When did you get started making knives and gear? I know you were doing things for yourself very early on, but just when did you start doing it as a commercial, a semi-commercial venture? In the late 90s, we got serious, started doing it on a professional level, 1999. Yeah. Yeah, so we've been doing this show 14 years now. Good to see you again, Stuart. Yeah, yeah, Thanks no worries, for taking man. time for the interview. Not at all. Um, yeah, we're all. having a great show, and um, yeah, it's been over 20 years now. It's been a long road and um, quite, quite an enjoyable trip. Yeah, yeah, we've had uh, we've had quite a few talks on the phone. Yes, sir. So I'll tell you what, let's get right into the uh, gear and equipment. Now these are these very are familiar. Crisis cards that we bring to all the show. We sell thousands of them there in use all over the world. Self-defense tool for um, defending against bad people. Yeah, yeah. And just for using it. It's, a lot of people use them for ice scrapers. Yeah, ice and, scrapers, uh, uh, ice chippers if necessary. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, maybe cutting a box open. Yeah, yeah, exactly. What is uh, price point typically? 100 bucks. 100? Yeah. Regardless of the intricacy? Yeah, they're all about $100. Right around that range, right? Yeah. Okay, next on the list? Uh, push daggers, $400. Cerakote, titanium handles, Velcro sheaths. These are our Pelican Bays. They're real popular. Magna Cut. It's patterned after Pelican Bay. I had a guy that worked for me that spent time in Pelican Bay, and he was notorious <laughs> for building shanks. Yeah. So he gave us some of his secrets to what really works good when you're trying to jack somebody in prison. So that's the Pelican Bay. They're 160, 180. Real popular. Push daggers are. We've got our own. No, silver. no, your push daggers are. Um, 400. 400. Okay, go ahead. We've got silver that we're having minted now, so silver rounds. Wait a minute, you're minting silver now? Yeah, yeah. The dream that we talked about 10 years ago? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Being the bank, right? Yeah. Yeah. So, good, good. What And what are those going for? 80 bucks. And I guess that also depends on price of silver, right? Doesn't yeah, yeah. Kind of you gotta, depending on spa, but they're usually $80. Okay. It's our collaboration with Artists and Cutlery, Titanium, CPM S90V. Ball bearings, ceramic detent. It's got our signature clip with the logo. These are about two hundred and fifty dollars. Handle material is titanium. Okay. Anodized in house. Right. The Macarta version is one hundred and twenty dollars. Leather pouches. You know we do a lot of leather. That's what we're talking about. We've got a hundred-year-old saddle stitch machine that we do all this with. We're looking at products that are going to outlast the owner. Yeah. Nice signature line. What are your what what would a pouch run? Approximately 100 bucks. Now, do you do some exotic materials out Yeah, we do too. It depends. So right. it could go up from there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, we build them out of alligator and it depends. We build a lot of bags for people, heavy duty bags, $250. We build a lot of belts. Um, Probably half our business is belts. We use American leather, 14 ounce leather. We've got ways to make it stiff to support concealed carry. And um, we use all American hardware. Belts start at about 100 bucks and go up depending on the material. Right. And you can dye them any color by by all appearances. Yeah, here. We, this is Italian leather. Some of the some of the leather, like this, is some people. I like the stiff belts for concealed carry, but some people like this softer leather, but Italian leather. So we use all kinds of stuff. And we've okay. got all different colors of threads and the whole deal. And it looks like you can do some. Uh, like a little... Yeah, some of them are textured and um, yeah. different things going on. Good, good. Very good. So everything is going well? It's a good show for us. Yeah, we enjoy it. We're glad to be here. We're just fortunate to, to be participating again. Glad to be here, man. Understood. Well, listen, man. Rock on. Thank you, buddy. You take good Appreciate care, brother. It. Okay.